Hello, this is a series of videos on gate preparation. This video we look at some basic tips on preparation for aptitude. First thing is get used to the you know, type of questions and pattern of the aptitude session. In gate aptitude, there are 10 questions for you know 15 marks. There are five one marks and uh, five two mark questions. And if you look about, like, say, uh, 10 previous year question papers, you start seeing a trend. Usually, there are, you know, out of these 10 questions, there are two to three from basic English. Okay? And then one or two from text inference, where they give a paragraph, small paragraph, then they ask you to infer something from the text. Okay. Then there is usually one question from data interpretation. They will give a table, figure, bar chart, one of those figures, then they will ask you to calculate some average, things like that. So there is a data interpretation question. Then there is one logical direction question. For example, they can specify three, four names and uh, mention some relationship between the names, few of the names. And then they ask, how is person A related to person B in the group? Okay, this is, the relations will be somewhat complicated that you know, some of them might start a family feud, but you will be able to detect what the relationship was. Just one example. There is one, usually one question in the paper from logical detection. Uh, relations is one thing, blood relations, could be many other things, seating arrangement, things like that. Then there are usually two quantitative aptitude questions. You know, questions related to speed, distance, time, time and work, and that. Perhaps percentages, or profit loss, etc. Then there is usually one basic math question. Uh, these are seventh standard, eighth standard, ninth standard mathematics questions. Uh, things like logarithms, then some basic summations, series, then LCM, GCM, and all those things. And sometimes they do ask one miscellaneous question. Uh, sometimes these are from spatial reasoning. But these miscellaneous could be from any problem. So simple thing is, uh, 10 questions, right? If you look at about 10 previous year question papers, you'll get an you'll start seeing a trend. Once you see a trend, see where you are good at, reinforce that, and see where you are weak at, and start working on those aspects. It's recommended that you score consistently 12 plus in all the mock tests that you give. 15 is often possible, and that's highly recommended. But get to a stage where you, you consistently get 12 plus in that period session. So once you are here, you pretty much get half of the marks that is required for cutoff. It's a very, very easy session. Get familiar with it, and practice properly, reinforce and practice properly get to this stage where you get you know, at least 12 out of 15 marks, then you are halfway past the cutoff. Then from the rest of the whole paper, getting 12 marks, 12, 13 marks, you cross the cutoff. Okay. So that's the thing. And uh, I, I'll try to upload gate BM 2021 solutions in a day or two, mostly by today. Okay, good luck. I'll see you again.